Hi guys, welcome back. 3333 Empress 33. Um, I'm going right off the top of my head on this one. This is going to be a pick a card. So it's the Hidden Truth Oracle is what we're going off of, guys. Okay, Hidden Truth Oracle. And then I have some cards I made up that I'm going to just use as well as these huge stacks of cards here. Okay. Someone's definitely watching you because I just split it and it says watching you. Okay. We're going to use this stacks as well. And that's it, guys. So I'm going to shuffle these right here on camera. Pick three. What does he, the masculine want to say to the feminine? Okay, because a lot of you guys are divine feminists watching this and divine masculines. Okay, uh, what does the masculine want to say to the feminine? Masculine wants to say to the feminine. What does the divine masculine want to say to the feminine? Three cards, please, for a pick a card. What does the masculine want to say to divine feminine? Use your intuition. That's why there's nothing going to be on top of these. Okay, one, two, three. It helps make, yeah, this one came out. All right, Divine Masculine. What does they want to say? This would be the overall energy for all three. Okay, you guys can pause the video or stop it, however you want to do. What's 137? So. All right, let's go, guys. For those of you guys that pick group one, Main energy is, I wish I could share my good news with you. Okay, let's look at that. What is this card? Represent this. Um, guys, please let me know. Okay, Six of Pentacles reverse. So this person could definitely, it could be money. It could be a gift they want to share with you. Yeah. For a lot of you guys, it's some kind of investment. Like, um, they wish they would have invested in you. Did equal give and take with you. Two, two, two on the clock. They just wish they would have, um, did better by you. Then they breadcrumbed you guys. Literally, they did. They did not share with you something they got. It could have been a financial something. Whatever happened financially, maybe they were doing well. They were giving to others, but they weren't giving to you. It showed me they're not giving to you. They didn't give to you at all, actually, okay? If they did, it was breadcrumbs. It wasn't nothing. It was just, you know, they didn't show you they appreciate you or, you know, they didn't invest in you. Okay, that's really what it's showing me. Seven of Pentacles surrounding six of Pentacles reverse. It's showing me they didn't invest in you. Um, Virgo, I'm sorry, the, the energy here is Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus, and Libra, okay? It wasn't balanced. It wasn't an equal give and take. Yeah. It was money. A lot of you guys, it was money. Here's the main energy for all the cards, all the groups. You were the best thing in my life. All right, guys, these are quick readings, so I'm not going to be reading too long, okay? They definitely want to communicate with you. My eyes were drawn to the Eight of Wands back here. I did see it. Yeah, they feel, too, you got competition. You got people fighting over you as well. Seven of Pentacles, they feel that they should have invested in you and gave you an equal give and take. That's coming back up again. What card is this? Yeah, the Chariot. Yeah. They also don't want you to move forward and be with someone else. Because that's what the main energy is talking about for all three groups. You were the best thing in my life. So group one, that's what they are feeling towards you as well. Any messages for group one? Making these very fast. All right, any messages for group one? It's only written on the one side, guys. See, only one side. So let's see, what does the masculine want to tell divine feminine for group one? Quick messages, guys. Wow, wait a minute. It's gone. It's gone on me. There we go. Okay, group one. Okay, that's a lot. It says talk. For your main energy, group one. Okay. Yeah, it ended. Death. 
it ended because they were not giving you equal give and take. You're like, why am I stay there? And you keep breadcrumbing me. You don't pay me attention. You don't give me what the same amount of energy I give you. I'm nice to you. You're not nice to me. You're not, you're not giving me what I give you. I'm giving so much more and you don't give me equal give and take. Okay, death card is death energy. You ended it. Strength. It took a lot of strength to end it. It took a lot of strength to end this. That's right, prioritize. They did not prioritize you, group one. Instead, they gave the other people and they breadcrumbed you. They didn't give you nothing, but they gave to other people. They didn't give to you. They had their prioritized wrong. They know that now though, because this was the main energy around that six of pentacles reverse, okay? Seven of pentacles is, is the main energy, meaning the whole deck here main energy when this came out in reverse they see you as they know they should have prioritized you group one seven of pentacles virgo capricorn taurus cautious they know you're now cautious of them because it wasn't balanced it wasn't equal they now want to invest though in you okay they want to move forward with you and that's the truth the ace of swords is back here yeah they want to move forward with you now but you're cautious towards them you're going to be experiencing some type of victory group one as well what is this sensual flirt this person could be liking you now or, or got interest in you some type of way because you let them go you ended it yeah you're mysterious that's why they're feeling this way towards you sensual and flirt they they don't know what to make of you you're you're kind of a puzzle to them group one let's see we have bored this could be it here they could be making a plan to come back to you but they're bored right now group one take it as apply destined okay disappointed and you could see that i don't know why but i see it in this card Seven of Pentacles. They feel they should have invested more time with you. They should have prioritized better. They should have made you um, the the person in their life. Okay, they didn't treat you right. All right, this card was left behind. It says sometimes I stay awake thinking about you. So you guys, all three groups, you guys got the same main energy because I pulled from um, the you know the same time. Okay, you were the best thing in my life. Sometimes I stay awake thinking about you. Okay, group one. That's all I have for you guys. Take care, guys. Let me see here. Turn that back. Hi, group two. For those of you guys that pick group two with your intuition, okay. Let's see. I remember every detail of that day. Let's see what about that day. Spirit, please clarify. I remember every detail that day for divine feminine, masculine. What does he want to say? What does he mean by this? All right, victory. Six of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Yeah. He felt great. He felt on top of the world. He felt victorious with you. At the bottom, like I said, is for all three. This is the main energy for all three groups. You were the best thing in my life. Sometimes I stay awake thinking about you. This person definitely be losing a lot of sleep over you guys, okay? They definitely want to come in and talk. Queen of Swords at the bottom of the deck. Again, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini energy. Some kind of air energy surrounding this um, victory. They want to talk. There's victory in them talking to you. I remember every detail of that day. Okay, guys, these are quick pick a card readings. So take it as applies. It's only one sided here with these. So here we go. What does the uh, masculine want to say to fit divine feminine? What does the masculine want to say to divine feminine right now? What does divine masculine want to say to divine feminine? Divine Masculine, I want to say the Divine Feminine. Okay. Neat. Divine Masculine, I want to say the Divine Feminine. Ooh. 
Okay. At the bottom we have health. Okay. We have crying. I remember every detail of that day. They said something they regret. Maybe at the time when they said this, I'm getting guys, they felt victorious in what they said. Like, hey, you know, I said this and I feel good about it. As time went on, they don't, re you know, they don't feel good about it no more. Okay, guys, we have dreams. Sorry. This person did something. Crying and sorry, guys. What is this? Message. They also don't know if they should message you because it's in reverse too. I'm looking at that as well. They're getting like cold feet when they try to message you because they are sorry for something that they did to you. They're saying that right now. They're sorry. A lot of them are definitely crying at this moment. Yeah, they want to come in. Okay. This person could be traditional. Yeah. Like a family person, family oriented family. Moon, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Take it as apply, guys. Prosperous. So some kind of way as well. There's extra messages here in this. Take it as apply. A lot of you guys are going to have some kind of victory in something. It's going to make you prosperous. Yeah, your gifts. You guys are gifted. Could be psychics I'm getting. Some type of psychic abilities. Able to read people, read energy future okay stability yeah financially stability is what i'm seeing there's some kind of victory you're going to have in your money as well group uh two and strength it was reversed i feel like this person gets cold feet when they try to gain up the strength to talk to you okay strength and message i'm noticing they were in reverse. It feels like someone is getting, this person's getting cold feet when they try to talk to you. They was like, I'm going to message you, you know, group two. I'm going to message you. I'm going to talk to you. But then they, they lose their strength to do it. They get cold feet. They get kind of scared. The moon card, they don't know, you know, the moon energy, guys. Um, it's just like illusions, delusions. They don't know everything. So that's it for you guys, group two. If it resonates with you guys, please like, share, and subscribe. Till next time, take care, guys. Let's move on to group three. These are quick readings. All right, very quick. Group three, let's see. I want to be more than friends. And the main energy, like I said, for all groups that we pull from is you are the best thing in my life. And sometimes I stay awake thinking about you. Okay, group three. Let's see. Clarify, I want to be more than just friends. Of course, we know it's, it's dating. It's going to the next level. I want to be more than just friends. Okay. Oh, they took too long. They could be a Libra. I also saw justice. Okay. It could be a Libra. You're getting some kind of justice. Could be because they took too long. There are a lot of them. They walked away from you or you walked away from them. Take it as apply. This is Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. This card of Pisces. Okay. And then the Knight of Pinnacle, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. This person took too long. It's like dragging their feet. Okay. They're not even moving in this card. They're telling. So they're just standing still. I feel like they're just standing still watching you. I want to be more than friends. Okay, let's see. Clarify this through for Divine Feminine. I want to be more than just friends. Clarify this. I want to be more than just friends. For Divine Masculine. I want to be more than just friends. Please clarify this. And that one fell out too. One on the ground, guys. I want to be more than friends. Tell me more. I want to be more than friends. Whoa. All right. We're going to stop. There we go, guys. They miss you. I see it. They are just sitting here. Why does this jump? Did you guys see that? Princess. They see you as the, a princess. 
Yeah, they want to be your knight shining armor. I see the armor. I was looking at that. And I was like, why am I noticing this? Okay, it's knight shining armor. They see you as you're their princess. Someone they want to take care of you. Oh, they they might want to control you. A little bit of devil energy there. Okay, Capricorn energy. But they do see you as their princess. A lot fell out. Wow. All right. So they, this person might have bad health at the moment. I am noticing the reverse of this. Okay. So this person might have bad health at the moment. Something with their health. Okay. Take it as apply, guys. There's a lot of cards. And it's only one-sided of cards. So it's not like I got to, you know, it's always one-sided on these. Okay. Death. You ended something with them. Yeah, they took too long. They're not moving. And that's why it says I want to be more than friends with you. They do miss you, though. This is the main energy when I stop. Oh, they're bored, too. They do miss you guys, okay? They miss you. Because it's something ended. Strength and death. So the strength to end it. The strength to move on. They didn't believe it. Maybe they didn't think you were going to move on. Positive. Okay. Let's see. Angel. Empress. Yeah, they see you as their empress, their princess. They see you as everything. They're thinking so much. Thinking. Uh, what is this? Awakening. See, it says sometimes I stay awake thinking about you. It looks like all they do is sit and think. Since they walked away or you walked away from them. All they do is think about you and what it could have been like i want to be more than friends admired okay i want to be more than friends admired so they could be coming off as an admirer just sitting back watching you habit they've been trying to break habits or something future we have starting we have cute they haven't told you that yet. That could be why it's reversed. They haven't told you that you're cute, that you're beautiful to them. Yeah, they're angry. They're angry at the moment. And we have disappointed and then moon. They don't know what to expect. Okay, guys. So that is your reading, group three. If it resonates with you, please like, share, and subscribe. Until next time, take care, guys. Thank you, guys.